a little component look like this, you know. It's actually quite high-end to be exact, you know, to be precise, I mean, you know, actually, I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Hello my little darlings and welcome back to my channel. Today is Monday, yes indeed, and it has been New Year's. And if you have noticed, I have had a week off, so I hope you had a good New Year's and a good Christmas, yes indeed. And today is the start of whole week, I do believe I will do this, or at least try to do this every year, because once every year I do buy a lot of makeup, at least once a year. <laughs> Where were I? I can't remember. I hope you have had a good New Year's and a good Christmas. Yes, indeed. You can tell me all about it down below in the comment sections. But today is not makeup or not something nerdy, but today is skincare. Yes, indeed. This is a pure skincare haul. Yes, indeed. So, without further ado, Let's jump straight into the video, but before we do that, please don't forget to press that like, subscribe and notification icon down below so you can become a part of the Darling Squad and the Degasmo family as well. Yes, indeed. So this is skincare, and I do believe that skincare is very important for everyone, especially as I put <laughs> On a lot of makeup, yes indeed, I have a proper desk now, so uh, if I do this a lot in uh, future videos, you will know why, because I am leaning against it, you know, and sometimes I lean too close to the edge and then I fall, go them down, yes indeed, it's not very nice indeed. Anywho, I have received and I have bought a lot of new skincare I want to try out during these coming months, yes indeed, because I am... Of course, a beauty channel and a gaming channel, and sometimes I buy stuff to try them out to give you a review, or if it's something I, you know, have never tried before, or if I have a different opinion than anybody else, you know. And I want to share with you my, you know, thoughts, and you know, you know how it works, yes, indeed. So let's just start showing off the stuff. The first thing I received is for a gift. This is the Naivea. Ultra Gentle Cleansing Makeup Wipes, I do believe they are called. 3 in 1 Gentle Cleansing Wipes for eyes, lips and face. Dry skin, removes waterproof makeup and gently cleanses. Leaves skin soft and smooth and mild and gentle for daily use. It's 0% colorants and alcohol, especially mild for the eyes, yes indeed. We are gonna be too about that, because my eyes are really sensitive for everything that can be allergic reaction adjacent. For everything that can cause an allergic reaction, I mean, of course. So these are the wipes I got, those I got from a special darling, yes indeed. Then I have bought two other packets with facial wipes, yes indeed, and both are from Cien, and it's their refreshing facial wipes, I do believe it's very very bright, yes indeed, but they look like this, or you know, adjacent to this, and the second ones are the sensitive facial wipes, yes indeed, it's, you know, one pink, and one blue package. They are really, really good for putting on makeup, no. Removing makeup, I mean, of course. And I have tried these before, and they are really, really good, so I can recommend those. They cost one euro a piece. So they are really, really affordable if you have a tight budget now in the New Year's. Yes, indeed. After the New Year's, I mean. Let's put those away. Yes, indeed. To continue on, I have something called tops. These are essentially Q-tips and they are coated in aloe vera and like 35 different chemicals. And they are for removing waterproof eye makeup along the water lines and stuff like that, you know. Or if you mascara smudges and that sort of stuff. They are of course sealed. Yes, indeed, I have not tried this before, so that will be very, very interesting indeed. Yes. So, and then those I also got for my special darling. Yes, indeed, he's very kind to me when it comes to buying a beauty stuff because he think it's a good thing that I do YouTube and he wants to support me in my quest for being the worst beauty guru ever. The next thing I got is also removers and makeup uh, removers and facial cleansers and that sort of stuff. So I will show you the gifts I have received. So the first one is a cleansing toner from L300. And this is a Swedish brand I presume, but I do believe you can get this in other places as well. And this is for normal to combination skin. And then I got 
from the same, you know, brand L300. It's a cleansing mousse, yes indeed. So it's like a foam, you know, and this is for dry skin. Yes, and I do have a lot of dry skin, you know. The next one is this. Let me see if I can say this without looking at the box. It's the La Roche-Posay and the rest I can't remember because it's in French and I'm not speaking French. So excuse me if I say this wrong. Demma Quilliant, you peu sensibles avec de le... Sensitive eyes. I make up removal, sensitive skin. It were in English below the French, so I don't know why I made it so complicated, I can I. Yes, indeed. So now what I have bought myself, and we are gonna continue with the cleansers and that sort of stuff. So I were at Lidl, shopping for groceries, of course, where else? And I bought a few of Cien's uh, newer items, you know, they have probably been around in stores for long, but... Uh, Sometimes they are at the store, sometimes they are not, you know, they come and go, you know, like exclusive limited editions items, but they do come back, you know, with regular intervals. So this is the Cien Nature 3-in-1 Cleansing Foam. Yes, indeed, it's a foam just like the L300 one, and this should be all natural. Yes, indeed. Certified natural cosmetics without silicones, whole synthetic fragrances and colorants, whole synthetic uh, preservatives. So this is completely natural, or at least they claim it to be natural. But it is with a lemon scent, and I do love lemons, so why not indeed? I thought this could be a good little guy to use, you know, in between all our stuff. I can't use the same skincare for too long because my skin really, really hates me if I do that. So that is why I have so much product. But they also last me for like a year. So I don't feel really bad about it in any case. So, you know. The next two things I bought were also from CN and it's in their new series. Or, you know, they have probably been around before, but I have never seen it before. It's their Hydro Expert. So it's one cleansing lotion, yes indeed, fancy blue bottle, and one cleansing gel, yes indeed, and these are infused with hyaluronic acid, so they are really, really, really moisturizing, 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 I can't say that word for shit. These are really, really hydrating, of course, should not dry out the skin, they should remove makeup. So, I do believe this can be good, you know, to compare with this little more fancy brand. Yes, indeed. Because it doesn't have to be fancy to be good, you know, or, you know, expensive to be good. I mean, this looks fancy to me, as well as this looks fancy to me, but, you know, it's two completely different price tags on these two. If this does a really good job, I probably want to buy more, but then I can't buy more, so that it's shit. But still, I probably can order them online or something, you know. And the last thing that is in a cleanser form or micellar water form is the Hydro Expert by CN. It's their micellar water. It's also infused with the hyaluronic acid and this is effectively cleanses and purifies the skin while re-moisturizing it you know i have uh, actually not smelled this so oh it's heavily scented but not too heavily scented <sniffs> it were like a mica in scent to this are those scented as well oh it's the same scent you know but it's not an overwhelming scent but it's that little you know chemically shape scent but not in a bad way you know because it doesn't have to smell bougie to be good you know scents are used for us it doesn't affect the product i rather have it smelling like chemicals than something very very heavy indeed i hate when product smells to the gods and you can't wear them for too long without getting a migraine for example so the last thing i bought at lidl it's the hydro expert cream gel moisturizer Yes, indeed. And I thought these were quite bushy as well, you know, because the little component look like this, you know. It's actually quite high-end to be exact, you know, to be precise, I mean, you know, actually, I don't know what I'm saying anymore. But it looks really, really expensive, high-end, you know. The component feels really, really sturdy, you know, it's not shaped in any way. And uh, they had actually two of these moisturizers, one 
cream gel and one clear gel. But both contain dimethicone and I hate dimethicone in my skincare and my moisturizers. So I actually bought this to use as a primer, you know, a skincare sort of primer. Because I know like Jeffree Star and many others use these vitamin infused uh, primers, you know, that comes in jars and they are really, really expensive. I can't afford those for shit. So I thought that why not try this? It contains the mitochone, the mitochone smooths the pores, and with the hyaluronic acid it will be really, really moisturizing. Moisturizing! And you know, I do believe it can work good as a primer, but uh, I do not know until I have tried it out as a primer, of course. But it contains a lot of skin carry, you know, items, or items, ingredients, I mean, like panthenol and the hydrogenated cocoa glycerates, you know, coconut oil. Citric acid makes the skin radiant and glowy and younger looking and that sort of stuff. And of course the only preservative in this is phenoxyethanol, what I can read out of this little tiny ingredients declaration on the back right there. So I will have to save this because I need to check every ingredients before I uh, do the review of course because I want to try to include that in my reviews as well. What they contain, if they contain allergens, if they contain you know stuff that clog up your pores uh, a lot you know if they are not good for sensitive skin or good for dry skin and bad for dry skin and that sort of stuff, you know. And if it's irritating and that sort of stuff, and then it can be good to check out those ingredients online on like Skin Charisma or Cost DNA. So I will try to include that in my future reviews. Yes, indeed. But I am actually really, really excited to try everything out. Yes, indeed, I am. So now I can finally put everything where it should be, not on the desk, you know, just like plopped right down where I sit, because if I don't put it in here, I will not film it, and if I just put it in the bathroom, it will just stay in the bathroom, and I will never ever film a video with them, forever, you know, it will just stay in there, and I will just hate myself for it. Yes, indeed, that is too much information for you, my darlings, I do believe, but I'm gonna actually before I say goodbye to you, I am gonna take away the metallic peel to smell it. It doesn't smell like shit, which is really, really good. And the consistency is exactly like a really, really hydrating primer, but uh, not, you know, weird or anything. So, thank you so much for watching my little darlings this skincare haul video and I hope you found some stuff that might be interesting for you I mean like this one perhaps or this one looked interesting, what do I know and uh, I don't remember the pricing for all of this but uh, some of the products I can't tell you the price on because I have not paid for them but like this was 2 euros 3 euros 6 euros uh, two euros and that sort of stuff so thank you so much for watching and I just had to give you that little quick uh, price recap because I didn't do that in the video yes indeed but don't hate me for that and press that like subscribe and notification icon instead so you can become a part of the Darling squad and the Degasmo family as well and never forget be who you are since nobody else can and I see you in the next one Bye!